How Princess Diana Exposed Sarah Ferguson's Split from Prince Andrew Princess Diana was the source of a leak which the furious queen thought came from Sarah Ferguson, a royal biography reveals. Princess Diana and Sarah Ferguson had a famously complex relationship, as the closeness of their early days transformed into a fraught and reportedly competitive friendship. A royal biographer has revealed how, in 1992, Diana betrayed this friendship with a scandalous press leak surrounding Fergie's split from Prince Andrew. These days, Fergie and Prince Andrew continue to fuel speculation about a rekindled romance, over 20 years after they parted. However, their split caused a great deal of strife for the Duchess of York at the time, during their separation in 1992 and on to their formal divorce in 1996. Over Christmas in 1991, the Queen advised that the couple wait six months before they decided to separate, but Andrew reportedly would not hear of it. Although the palace tried to keep it under wraps, news of the Duke and Duchess of York's separation broke in March 1992. In her 2007 book The Diana Chronicles, author Tina Brown reveals, the Queen was personally infuriated by the leak. The leak was ruinous for Fergie's relations with the palace and later would severely affect her financial negotiations during the divorce. The palace was convinced the Duchess had handed out the information herself even accusing her of hiring a PR company to hand over the information to the press. Ems Brown claims that, in an off-the-record briefing at the time, the Queen's press secretary called Fergie unfit for royal life. This led to the infamous BBC headline The Knives Are Out for Fergie at the Palace. Fergie revealed in her 1996 autobiography, I had been tagged unsuitable for royal life and the charge stuck. I was frozen out and not just in the palace. The wind from all the doors slamming in my face might have knocked me over. However, Brown reveals how Fergie had actually not been the source of the leak at all. She writes, After Diana's death, Andrew, Morton finally revealed that it was the Princess of Wales who had served up her erstwhile best friends to provide a necessary press distraction. Andrew Morton was selected by the Princess of Wales to write Diana, her true story which the princess collaborated on. A rival book was due out weeks before Diana's own in 1992, and the Fergie distraction was needed to throw the uncomplimentary tell-all book off the front pages. The Morton book would go on to cause a myriad of problems of its own for Diana with the royal family. However, Brown says, the Duchess never suspected Diana as the source of the leak.